the third party processing, as you see here with this giant R, is meant for an exportation of the reference body uh, so that the CEREC can actually mill that component uh, for the CEREC guide process. So once we click on this R button, the software will pop up another box and it's asking us to export a .cmg .dxd file. Now .cmg stands for CEREC meets Galileos and the .dxd file is meant for the drilling template file itself. When I hit export, it'll simply allow me to open that file up within the CEREC software and when I open that file up you can see that this is the block that I'll be using and the block already has a master hole in the block. What the CEREC will be doing is milling this object out of the block and this object will simply replace the reference body from the CEREC guide scanning appliance. To see everything here let me activate the implant so you can see the relative position of the implant and certainly let's take a look at the model as well. And I hope that that clarifies the process for CEREC guide. It still may be a little bit complicated uh, for the audience only because they're not existing users of this, uh, certainly the, the Galileos and the process of making a surgical guide. But in summary, what I've done is I've actually generated a plan and I will now be able to mill a component that will let me fabricate a surgical guide all in one visit. Collectively, I think we've spent about 30 minutes up to this point. Uh, and certainly less time if I have not, uh, if I did not have to explain everything. But we're ready to mill this um, CEREC guide. And I'm going to show you the block that we're going to be using right here. This block is the large block because I used a large reference body, so it corresponds to the reference body that we've selected. And I'm simply going to walk over to the milling chamber, mill this, and uh, it'll be ready in about 10 minutes. So I'll go ahead and walk over to the milling machine right here. We're going to simply insert this block into the milling chamber of the MCXL, which is what is required to do CEREC guide. We're going to lock in the block. I'm going to close the lid here. We're going to do a little song and dance. And uh, in summary, that's uh, how we mill the reference body.